Howdy y'all, I'm Around the Wheel, you're watching Chips Challenge, Money Never Sleeps, and today we're starting out in the slime. We've gotten ourselves in the slime house, probably with Melinda or something, but this is In the Slime by Chuck and Bill. That's Chuck Somerville and probably Bill Dara, who, as we have historically seen, makes kind of boring levels. Hopefully this one is not too boring because it's a single screener. Looks like we have to get all of the slime cleared out so that we can, uh... So that we can do fun things like uh, like get okay, and we're gonna have to get a we're gonna have to get a block into here eventually to make our way to the exit. But I think I'm gonna start out with some. I think I'm gonna start pretty liberally at first with this with this deal. I think what we might want to do is get this going. I don't want to get this too far over to the... I don't want to get any single block too far over to the left or right. Let's just kind of push them around and see what we can make. Let's see what kind of... Okay, we can get this back up into here. Let's go ahead and save this block for now and see what we can do with the rest. The rest of the story, as it were. We can get two more here. I feel like I'm really pushing this down into places where I'm not going to be able to recover it from. But why don't we just why don't we just stick to our guns for a second? As long as we are not crazy with it, I think I just got crazy with it actually. Whoops. Um. Okay, so go here. Maybe do a little of this, a little soft shoe here. Okay, for a first attempt, not too bad. You can't push over chips. That makes plenty of sense. Okay, all but two on my first try. So I'm, I'm willing to give it another try before I really force a solution on camera. Uh, or off camera, rather. I feel like I need to do this over here, but I feel like also that might be potentially already screwing myself. And we wouldn't want that, now would we? I've, I've never done that before, no sir. Okay, so now, now we have places to push things. We have places to push this one. Uh, I kind of feel like pushing it down. If I get too far on any one, oh hey, that's nice. That's, uh, actually that's not that great because I can't really get around it at all. And again, I've made a big mess, and I got even fewer chips than I did this time. This isn't really... This is the kind of thing you really gotta map out. I'm really just trying to make it a bit of a guessing game right now, but it is not amenable to that sort of thing, really. Yeah, and I did that up, even though I can't get in there. Why? Eh, this doesn't seem that bad. You just gotta... You just gotta know what you're doing. Hey, all right. Okay, yeah, that one did take quite a minute to do, but it's actually one that I think allows for a fairly reasonable margin of error, which is, I like that. I always like that in a level. We'll probably try to speed that up a little in edited and post, you know, that kind of nice little business, but actually not too bad a little level and one you can actually kind of relax with despite the time limit. I enjoyed it quite a bit let's move on then to swivel motel okay there's gonna be one way out of here this is a this is a one-way swivel motel and where are we gonna find is this the best place to enter first looks like it might be ha <laughs> no actually not wow already restarting on the 
on the first little bit here. Oh, wow. So neither, unless I, unless I really, uh, okay. Yeah, I can do that, but then, okay. Okay. This one's going to take a little, this one's going to take a little thinking. I'm doing some stinking thinking here. Pop, 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 pop the bottle. Let's see. pop -matic trouble. It's fun getting into trouble, so the commercial says. Okay, hey, I finally found the way out of that one, so that's one chip down. So we're going to have these little rooms, it looks like, and I'm going to have to figure out how each one works in order to... Oh, my. Well, the bulk of the chips are in this one, so if I can figure out this room, uh, I may I may have uh, a solution on my hands here. Okay, let's go ahead and... Uh, how do we want to pop this out here. I want to make sure I can get out of any given situation here and I cannot get out of that middle one. Let's walk around and pop all these doors actually. Um, okay. If I go through here, um, which way, which way will allow for popping? If I, I think if I go, no, I gotta go back around here. Oh man, this one's gonna be, this one's gonna be tricksy. Okay, there are definite ways in and out of all of these little situations, but I don't know what the best one is for any given one, unless I've already messed this up beyond repair, which is also a possibility. Oh boy, the Swivel Motel is not... Not very amenable to fun and games, it doesn't look like. I can tell, like, just about any situation I get myself into here. I'm going to... Boy, I am really royally... Okay, let's try... Yeah, pretty much all of these are... Are... Screwtown USA. Uh, if I... If I go through any of them and... If I leave any of them... Uh, that middle one, that middle one is upsetting. The middle one is real upsetting. Yeah, see, because if I go through here, I could get, well, just about all of these, but then I end up getting myself stuck, and then I need a way out. So, eh, I got almost all the chips in the level, honestly. That level is going to be, or that room, that room down there, that's the one to figure out, because that's where most of the chips are. Uh, maybe we'll, I should definitely try to solve that one first, I think. Well, that one's pretty easy now. I've got that one pretty much solved. Ha <laughs> ha! Hooray! Uh, this one has a block in it, though. Uh, how do I do that? Uh, well, oh, I can do that. Okay, that's interesting. And then I can pop that down in there and then get out of here. Oh, that one was actually pretty easy, too. Okay. All right, now I feel like I'm on a roll. Ah, the big brain juice is working. How do we get in here? Oh, there's, there's logic to be solved. Oh, no. Oh no, I'm not very good at logic. Well, I've got my way out of here at least. Um, how about... Uh, okay. Oh no, I did a bad. I'm pretty sure I did a bad just now. I can, I can, you can kind of feel in your bones when you do that, you know? Oh, hey. No, maybe not. Okay, so I blow this up. Oh yes. Aha, there we go. And I let myself... Wow, boy, I am on a roll. It's this one that's sticky and tricky. Okay, okay, so now, now we can, uh, I feel, aha, if you go in this way, yeah, you can already pretty much immediately see you're boned, just like Joshua Bone would have you be boned, I know, I know, he's a, he's a bonester, that bone man. Oh yeah, that was an easy one, okay, yeah, you can just pop out one of the, one of the two corridors there, okay, this one involves a key and some force shoes, I like the little mini puzzles going on here, there's a... There's a lot to enjoy about this one, I do think. Okay, so, hmm. So, if we take the, f okay, I can't even really fully see into this one. Maybe we should just take them as they go, and then, once I, uh, this one is the really tricky one right here. I can, this one is, this one is the one that's gonna give me trouble. So if I can kinda, uh, maybe I was lying about solving this one first. You know, I do that from time to time. Little white lies. They don't hurt anyone. Uh, just go up in here. Let's try to solve this one now. We have... Okay. We come up in 
here. We're going to... How are we going to get ourselves out? We're going to take this way, maybe? Go through here? That gets us the key. Oh, yeah. So I have some... Well, I did have some four shoes, but... Okay. Yeah, I should be able to now just walk around this way. Okay, there we go. Got the four shoes. The four shoes make that one not so bad. Okay, but we're going to need to maybe enlist the thief here because I'm going to need to get... Okay, I think what I need to do is come up in here. Let the thief take my shoe, my four shoes, because I don't think I'll be needing those anymore. I will need them... Oh, I need both shoes to get into this room. Okay, so that said... Let's go ahead and... Oh boy. Okay, we're gonna have to pop one of these open. Or we could leave them both. Huh. I feel like I need to leave myself a way out of here, maybe. Like, uh... Huh. Does this... Does this... Does this pop-up floor layout have something to do with how I need to leave the door? Because I need to... I need to leave this like this. But then I can't get out, I don't think. Okay, I'm gonna pop this here, and I'm gonna come out this way. Thinking that later what I'm gonna need to do is come out that way. So, and I'm going to try kind of the same thing here, but I think we're going to get through this in one shot, see. Okay. Because what I need to do is get out of here with everything intact. Oh, I don't have, and you have the time limit, so you don't have much time to actually study it, which is unfortunate. But... Okay, I'm gonna go into the room. I'm gonna go into the room and I'm going to commit. I'm gonna commit to the room. But I don't want to get this stuff stolen, see? Because... Well, I think it's pretty simple, actually, now that I look at it. Get this, get these, and you can leave through here. Yeah, okay, I did have it set up the right way to do that. Okay, very good. And then all I have to do is get out of here safely by going which way? First, I'm going to come up in here because you got to get these stole... Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe I should have uh, dropped those off somewhere. Maybe I should have dropped the... I bet I should have dropped them off in each little square. Yeah, yeah, because I'm going to need to get back out of there. That's That was a mistake. I'm running out of time anyway, so I don't think it's the worst thing ever but okay yeah this is another one where you just want to pop it twice i think so that you come down here yeah i should have left the fire boots on the fire square and the water flippers on the water square i know for next time wasn't going to beat this level this time anyway but i'm slowly figuring it out and i am enjoying it bummer time bummer yep all right let's use what we've learned drop fire on here drop flippers on here and then come in here and yeah, it should be pretty simple to pop through. You gotta do a twice pop on that one. And then, hey, I'm safe. I'm safe once more. I'm figuring out this game. I'm figuring out all the weird little tricks. Oh, this is a big room. Oh, this one right here is huge, in fact. We've hit on the gold mine, maybe. Are we gonna Are we gonna end up letting somebody, There's a. there's an animal dance going on here. Oh my. Oh, yeah, so the rest of the chips are in that one room. So, yeah, there aren't many rooms to solve. Just got that one left. Okay. And then after that, it's kind of an enemy gauntlet. Okay, so you survive the challenge, and then you have to... Oh, man. And then there's a maze. So you do the rooms, then you do the maze, then you do the gauntlet, then you get the money, then you get the power, then you get the women. Got it. <laughs> Obviously, I'm a, I'm a big brain genius. I know plenty of things. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, all the rest of the chips are left in here. So I just have to figure out how to go about this then. 
I'm just going to go around in a loop right now. For now, I'm just going to go around in a little fun loopsy doopsy. Well, hold on. Just a second. Do I actually have to go in the middle at any point? I don't think I do. I think I can just... Yeah, there we go. All right, yes. See, when you eat your Wheaties, you can figure it all out. See, I've got the world all figured out. The world according to Chip, as it were. There we go. So now we get to go to the next part. All right. Feeling good. I'm feeling good about this one. Things could still happen. Things could still go awry. But I'm still enjoying my time with this level so far. And I have plenty of time. Oops. Nope. That. Oh, yeah. I got to go get the chip socket. Oh, this is just a. Oh, this maze is a huge red herring. Okay. So there's no maze involvement at all. It's just a. It's just a way to waste some of your time. But that's all we do here on the Round the Wheel channel anyway, is waste our time. So, yeah, there we go. All right. All right, make my way inside. Make my way indoors. What do I need to... Does anything need to be done with this block? Maybe. Uh, so we have to make a way for... Oh, okay. There's a, there's a puzzle to be solved here. I um, feel like I need to maybe take this up into here. It's given me a nice little out to do so. Oh no! Or maybe not oh no. Let's see. Um, okay, that block is just there for reasons. Uh, oh, maybe I wanted to push it onto here. Oh, you know what? That's, that's probably that's probably the thing to do. Because yeah, I can't hmm. Oh boy. So I have to divert, does it look like I have to divert the fireballs? Because I don't want them melting that thing, for sure. Let's see, what, ha what happens if I... This is just a thing you have to get through to ensure that you kept your boots and stuff. I think. I don't think there's anything to be done with this, really. But I think I have to get my ice block down in there. So I have to use the fire, I have to use this block then to divert the fireballs. Probably keep them, probably push it like down here to keep them all in this little, all in this little loop right here. And then I can push the ice block down into here to, to splash the, well, is that, a, is that what I do? I don't know. Um, hmm, I think I get it, maybe? Okay, entering into here with plenty of time to solve, and I think I have, I think I have the idea. I think I want to get them going. Hopefully this doesn't cause chaos when I do this. Oh, nice. Oh, gosh, that was so clean. Oh, boy. That was so clean. Smells like green apples. All right, so what this should do now, I think I can push this onto here. Hopefully I don't, I, I kind of want to get it. Okay, oh, all right, okay, good. It took care of both, excellent. So I cannot leave, I cannot have the fire boots, so I'm not safe there. Okay, so this is, this is dying time right here. Okay, so I think what I wanna do, all right, all right, you wanna pop through certain parts of the puzzle at the times that are right, like down here. There we go, all right, wow. Okay, I had a lot of fun with that one. Uh, there were there were multiple parts to it, but they weren't too bad. And once you figured it all out, ooh boy, ooh, I had enough fun today that I think I'm just gonna stop there while it's good. It may result in a little shorter episode than usual, but I am fine with that. I have played some satisfying Chips Challenge levelage today, and we are going to leave it at that.